Good morning. I hope everyone is well. We are going to work on Junk Journal July. This will go on all year, you know. I'm way behind. But I, I always said I wasn't going to finish it straight away. Like, you know, in July. So um, I'm going to work on Wanderlust to start off with. So I could just go to this page. It's on the other pages. Okay, so they're done. Right, so Wanderlust is like a desire, of, we all know, a desire to travel. So I thought I would, um, I might not go on that page actually. I thought I would um, um, sort of write down what the definition was and also... Um, I think I like the colours here, these three pages here. And um, I'm just sort of write a little bit about, um, which I won't do on camera, but write a little bit about how um, I have this desire to go home and just to go somewhere. And I've mentioned that to you before. And, um, and maybe a little bit how this um, rotten pandemic, rotten for many reasons, has also... Um, you know, stop me from seeing my family, and what and and lots of us, many of us, haven't been able to see our family. So, um, it's very hard. Like you know, m my childhood friend who lives in London, she's one of my best friends. She, she lost her dad, in and he lives in Sydney, and she hasn't seen him since. She didn't get to see him, um, since two thousand and nineteen, and it's been really devastating for for her. So, um. Yeah, so, you know, this is really, really tough on so many of us. And if I don't stop talking, I'll probably get teary. So let's, um, you know, I'm pretty, pretty um, positive person, um, as you probably figured out. But, you know, if I think about things that make me sad, then I get teary sort of thing. So I try not, my way of coping is I just don't think about it. That's the way I deal with it. So, yeah, I think we'll, we'll, we'll do that. So I've got this picture. This is Lily. You can hardly see her. Um, it's at one of our favourite beaches in Sydney. It's a harbour beach in the harbour. Look, isn't it beautiful? I put a little filter on the photograph and I printed it out with my sprocket. And um, and she's kind of looking off into the distance. So um, that kind of reminds me of Wanderlust. And then this is a photograph in Tuscany last year. It's very small. It's that famous road. I never knew where it was exactly. I know there's one near Siena where all the cypress trees are. They're always on the um, uh, postcards. And this was Pien um, Pienza. Yeah, Pienza in Tuscany. Not far from Monte Montepulciano. Um, and so I've just put a little filter on that one too because it was kind of like late in the afternoon and hot and, and it was kind of hazy. So I just I think the filter made it look better. But I like that because that's I have a big desire to to go away somewhere, and we're not risking going out of Italy, but we we're going, um, as I mentioned to you in the previous video, we're going to Tuscany again, but we're going to go to a different area, like near not far from Florence, because we'll go and see our friends, but in the, more in the countryside. So I've got some. Actually, I've just got this lovely piece of. Um, tea dyed I don't um yeah I do tea dyeing um tea dyed sort of paper here so I might put that so a little bit of that somewhere and I'm having, I'm having trouble gathering my thoughts today aren't I I'm just going to tear a bit off I want to be able to have a little area to write but I also want to attach the images and I also don't want to cover but I am going to cover maybe I'll change pages because I don't want to cover all of um this might be better here I didn't want to cover all of that um, lovely um, old book page. So maybe I'll go here. So I need a bit more paper. Put this there. And then I'll do something there. So how is everyone today? I hope you're all well. I didn't do a video yesterday. I don't know. Which the day just sort of disappeared. I was making um, making up fabric packs because I ran out and it took all day until I went to bed. I did have a little break because it gives me a backache doing that sort of stuff. But um, 
yeah, it did take all day and I just thought, well, I should get it done because I had it all in the middle of the room and, um, you know, in everyone's way. So I watched the Olympics. I watched the, the girls' gymnastics, the all-round, I think it is, but the individual all-round, not the team all-round. And, yeah, I'm just a bit confused about the program. I just don't know what's really what's coming next, what's happening with the Olympics because um, I don't have, you know, like a list sort of thing to to know. Uh, now, I do have these. Oh, they're so pretty. I'm just wondering whether I want to use... I kind of would like one of these there. I think I'm going to cut that out, this one. This is typical of me. This is the way I work. I don't even plan my page out. I've got no idea. It just happens and sometimes as you all know I do stick things down I think oh would have been better if I would thought about that but I won't learn the lesson it just happens it's very organic it's just you know uh, it just comes out of me and I stick it down and think and then I have regrets so if you're able to plan do that um, I seem to struggle with it I just like the colours. That's what I'm liking there. But I do need to put... Oh, I can put my... I could put my image... I think I'll put this image here on this side. But I don't... You see, I don't like that. I'll tell you why. Because it's on the same side. I'd have to have it over there. So I need to put something there before I glue down. So being a good girl, I'm, I'm looking at it before I do any gluing. Um, now let me see. Where's my scrap thing? Oh, but I don't, I don't want to cover that up. Oh dear, being difficult. I could have a piece of this one. So what is everyone working on? You're working on journals, are you doing this? Are you stitching your tag? Your Anne tag, let's call them Anne tags. Oh, she'll be publishing it, the next one soon. Oh my goodness, what is she going to do to me this week? What are you going to do to me, Anne? My brain might collapse the, having to think about, um, think outside of the box too much. Okay, so this time I didn't start with a uh, book page, did I? I started with some coffee dyed paper but start yeah always starting with something fairly neutral in the background and then my page just evolves from there hopefully you can see there's a bit of a reflection there so there we go there's a collage page got a bit of a print couple of pieces of printables there and then that so and i can i can squeeze in some writing there so let's just I'm, i am i have decided i'm sticking this one on here i just got to peel it off. Because the the really good thing about the sprocket, anyone who hasn't heard of it, is um, it has, the paper is self-adhesive adhes paper. And, it's crooked. Well, anyway, we'll just stick it down. It's adhesive, it's, it's adhesive paper. And it, um, it's self-inks. So you don't buy cartridges, you just buy the paper. So you kind of know where you, it's like it's good in the sense that uh, you always know where you're at. You don't have to, um, you know, you don't know whether your ink's going to run out anytime soon. Now I'm wondering if I'll stick that there and that there. Yeah, I think so. Or do I want it round the other way? Let's just try. I think I prefer that. Okay. still want to stick some other paper down I think before I put my image down um, I'm just looking around to see what I've got got 
very little. Oh, I like that. I quite like that. I think I'm going to stick that there. I don't know. I think I like this because it's got the blue in it, but it also then, and which kind of picks up these dark blue greens, and it, and then the this colour here sort of picks up this colour up here. That's why I like it, even though it's modern, and the other part is not so modern. But it, I don't know. It just works for me. So I'll put that there. Oh, I wanted to snip the corners. I didn't snip the corners off the other one. I like the corners cut off. Just, I, I guess it just makes it a little bit less obvious and regular. Put that there. Okay, yeah, see, they, I like them better with the, the corners cut off. And, well, there's really not that much to do there. I need to stamp Wanderlust. So I'll stamp that onto a label. So uh, where's my Tracy Fox here? I know she's got some long empty labels here. I think I might do one of these. Now, do I want to do blue? Yeah, maybe blue. Let's just cut this one down. Could put that there, yes. I'll stamp that. So I need these. Let's pull all of those out. Okay, let's look for my W. And then I need I'm trying to find my A. Do I need any in there? No. Those are numbers, we don't want that. There it is. W A N. Oops. Looking for my D. It's a bit no. There's my D. Where's R? Wonder. I'm wondering if I <laughs> wonder. I'm wondering if um, I can get my whole word done without, you know, having to do it in two parts. Looking for my L. Here it is. L. And that's N. No, that's U. I think I can. Yes. I need T. That's my T. That's a big S. I don't want a big S. Hmm. There it is. Okay. We're in action. And I'm going to print, I'm going to print it, I'm going to stamp it. Just fits with what colour. I don't want to do blue. I want brown. Okay. 
pan. I do the, the Versafine clear, this brown. I like this pine cone brown more than the, for this, more than the coffee. I think I've got ink on there. I won't go straight. I know me. Good. Just fits. So I'll just carefully put that there. Let's move that over there. I'm going to keep that out because I might need it again. And I'm going to write just quickly. I won't write all the other stuff, but I'll just write this. I can't find my pen. Where's my pen? It's probably here on that. Here it is. Just write a desire to travel. Okay. And then I'll write Pienza. 2020. I'll write somewhere. Okay, that fills in that little bit there. And I'll write the other bit here. And I think I need to decorate here and here a bit further. I'm getting enough glue on there. It's oh, alright. Okay, so I think. Like I could have written on there as well, but I don't think I will. I changed my mind, as you do, or as I do. I'm going to put Oh, I do like that. I don't want to cover that up though, so let's see what other flowers I've got. Such a mess. I did like that yellow one, but I don't want, as I said, I don't want to cover up the, the urn. I think I'll put that one there. Let's just see. Or do I prefer, maybe I just prefer the yellow colour with this spread. No, that's not big enough. Oh, I think I like that one. Have I used that one already here in this book? No. But be careful with this one. It's very, um, you know, it has a lot of um, cut out bits. So I, I easily rip those. And I've got a big blob of glue on there. So I'll have to clean that. Okay, so I like that page, and now I've got to. I'm going to leave that bit for writing. I might stick something up here a little bit. And there, I think I might have, I don't want a big bird. No, I don't know if I want a bird. I probably need a cockatoo. I don't have a cockatoo here. Cockatoo would be good. Don't just need a cockatoo. You just don't have one when you need one, do you? I want the owl. I want a cockatoo and I don't have one. I have to go and print one up. Don't even know if I want a bird. Let's just 
just have a quick look. Oops, I'm dropping. I've dropped so many things on the floor, I can't tell you. Okay, I don't want those. I don't want any birds. Let me just pick up my oh, things. Okay. Um... Oh, I did have those, but I don't think the the ladies sitting on the rock in a well. I do like that actually. So maybe here, put them up there because they're in Australia. Such an Aussie thing to do is to go and I don't. I can write there and there. So what I could do here is maybe make that a bit more writing. So I think I'll stick the ladies there because they remind me of Australia. And I feel like I need a bit of something up there. I've got this bit of painted paper here. Just want to see if I might like that. No, it's not big enough. So not that. Let's just tear this. I think I might... See, this is what I do. I put that down, and I know it's a, it's a shame. It's a lovely old piece of paper. But I feel like that's where I'm going to do my bit of writing now. And I'll have, just have that paper peekabooing through. It's all a bit of a process, really. So I'll do some writing there. That way I don't have to write too much, do I? Ha <laughs> ha. And I want to put that there. I don't want to put a little bit of something behind it. Just to... I do have this. No. Okay. Put that over there. I put all my papers on, just a sec. I could change my mind a million times. Just want to see what I've got over here in my land of printed papers. Oh, isn't that pretty? Maybe I don't, I could just not have the ladies I could have. Now what the ladies? Decisions, decisions are the worst, you know. got to work this out so if I were to oh, I think I might glue them I know I'm covering up the bed it doesn't matter I can print it out again I don't know why I'm fussing about it I just have those colors peeping out from behind I'm gluing it down first, so that way I can tear. Getting my glue everywhere. It's just going everywhere. It's driving me bonkers. Can you tell I haven't been in here for a few days? Are you still filming? Yes. Oh, okay. Sorry to disturb. Hi, guys. Hi, Lulu. I'll come back later. No, don't. Oh, is it something you don't want to talk? No, I can ask you now, but... Oh, is it something... You. Oh, you're not... Dis you never disturbed, Lulu. Can I go out to Santa Candela this afternoon? Yes. Okay. You can. You may. Thank you, Daisy. Thank you. I 
think I'll just put that there. Do I want a little bit of And just to sort of get some glue there, that's annoying me. Right there. Um, just to um, sort of, so I feel like it's a bit more finished off, I'm just going to put not very good gluing going on here. I might I like to do it double and that one I'll do like this so it looks like a picture well it is a picture but you know what I mean it looks like it's hanging on the wall oh, I quite like this spread now so it is a bit of a struggle because I don't pre-plan things but to figure it out okay a bit of doodling there and I feel like I'm wondering, do I want to, there'll be writing there, do I want to put a little tab on there at all? Do I? That's the question. That is the question. Probably that one. So nothing fancy, just putting a regular paper sort of tab on there. And I've got that there, so I can put it down here, or up, I think I'll put it up there. And to make it look more integral, I'll just redraw a line over the top. There we go. Okay, so that's that Wanderlust is done. Wanderlust. Now, in the garden, well, in the garden, I well, let's do in the garden. What I was thinking for in the garden was, I might do it on that page. I was thinking I might do a, a garden scene. How about that? So, Let's just see. I'm going to use my printed out flowers and I'm going to create a garden scene because I don't I don't work in our garden. So um, I don't want to cover up all the background of this, um, this you know, old sort of receipty sort of invoicey sort of thing. Um, yeah, I don't we don't I don't work in our garden like it's a communal garden, you know, for the apartment building. So I don't do anything in it. You know what I mean? I could do something. Put that one over there because we'll go right across the page. One. Oh, I quite like that. Um, what else do we have? I need something maybe a bit more sort of blue or pink. No, I think I like the bushy one. I'm saying it's bushy. It's not really a bush, but you know what I mean. The more bushy one. I'm just trying to say, I don't think I've got any blue ones left. I might have used them all. I know that's blue, but that's not the shape that I'm looking for. Could use that one. Yep, I don't think there's anything blue in here. Okay, that's all right. We, we will survive without the blue okay so i'm going to actually go ahead and start gluing these down because they're drab me bananas swinging about now i just need to what i need to do is just put that there so i have, think my clips are in the other room right so let's glue this one there near the t
oh gosh I get chunks of glue everywhere it's like I, la I love to lacerate my glue I said near that tip there just take the chunk of glue off and I didn't get any glue on this bit whatsoever Okay, let's glue this flower down. I like making garden scenes. It's not the first time we did the garden, um, we did the garden journal cards, I think, in the Roxy's Weekly Challenge. We did, and that was fun. Okay, and then I had this one. Just stay there. Oh my goodness, I always manage to get the glue on the wrong side. Put that in there. I know I'm covering up a lot of the invoice, but it doesn't matter. Okay, and then I'm going to put this one here. That one's not going to work. No. Not that one, I'll put that one. Maybe I'll just put that one. I wish I had a blue one. I did say I would survive without it. Oh, just a minute, I got more. Just a minute. I noticed that I had some more here. Ha <laughs> ha, I can get a blue one. This will be good and it won't take too long to cut. So I had kept those aside because I wanted to um, tear them up with the background and not fussy cut them, but I'll just have to fussy cut one of them. I'm br um, yeah, I'm just fussy cut one of them because I need it now because I can always reprint them. I'll just whiz around. I might like to put that one. I might put it there. No. I'll put it. Put it. Maybe there. That's it. Oops. I am the worst gluer. I look at the glue just the worst it's all sticking to me it's just a nightmare my glue keeps falling down and sticking to things it's just not the best glue day Bring it over. Stick that one there. Yes, that's okay. 
Okay. I think I want one of these to stamp in the garden. So, of course, this is what my garden would look like if I had one that I was looking after. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I don't need to add that to my plate. I think I could have that down there even. Oh, why don't I stick that down there? That solves that problem down there. Okay. I'm, well, will I stamp it first? Yes. Okay. Here we go. Got to find the, the letters. Uh, I want a big I. So I've got Wanderlust there. Okay, got I, little n, in. Okay, let's just put those there and then I don't I need all small letters now T okay in the G Do you think I can find my A? There it is. Ga D oh, that's a Q. B E and I should have an N here somewhere because I used it before. In the garden. Okay, so that's my in the garden. I haven't finished the page yet, but I've stamped it. And we'll glue it in place. Okay, we don't need any more flowers. Now we need, I think I'm gonna put a butterfly on that page. So let's see if I've got any appropriate little butterflies. I don't want a huge butterfly. I could have that one, that's cut out from a book. I think I might like a printed one more. That one's okay. I like that one better. Okay, we'll just go with that one. Will I audition another one? No, I'll go with that one. So that page is done. I'm not going to write anything on this page. There. Now here we need some sort of butterfly there as well. And then we need a bird. Did you know that was coming? They're too big. I'm rejecting all of the butterflies. They're all being rejected. I quite like that one. Just a minute. That one was too pale. I didn't it wasn't I didn't fancy the colours with what I've got going on in the background. Maybe I'll have a few little ones. Oh I like that one more. Okay, so we'll put that there. Do we need another little one? Maybe over there? Yes. Okay, so that fills in that space. So we'll glue those down. 
pad work. So I've created a little garden scene put in the garden. And I could leave it, I don't have to put a bird on, but I think I might, I'll see. I'll audition the birds and we'll see if that one will go on the page. I like the colors in the background. Okay, so I'm remove the butterflies from our view and grab the bird box. Right. Nope. Excuse me while I audition the birds. That will take a minute because there's a lot of them. I want one on the ground. I quite like that one. That's a possibility. I love this guy. He goes everywhere. This one's... Oh, that one's nice. That's nice. I like the owl, but we won't use the owl because I use the owl quite often, don't I? It's quite a favourite. The one on the log. I love that bird. I don't know. I love the colours in that bird, I think. I love these birds, but I use those all the time too, don't I? They're very popular birds. So popular that I have many printouts of them. That's on a branch. So we don't want to interfere with the flowers. I use that bird all the time too. Okay, we're nearly there. I've nearly just, I love that bird. I love that bird. Okay, well, we've, we've established that I love the birds. So we're going to choose between this one. And I really like the blue. It brings in the blue from over there. And so, yes, it's the blue one. There we go. That did not take long at all. Of course, I got glue everywhere. And there's my bird. One last thing I wanted to look at. I don't know. I don't know what I've got in these ones. I've got botanical. I could have put that on my botanical page. I didn't think about that. What's here? Herbaceous. This is one of those times when you might like one of these um, ones with the definitions. I actually don't have many left because I put them everywhere. Seedlings. No, I don't think I really have room for big labels. I could have room for a little label, you know, something like that. I could stick a stamp. I quite like that. What day is it today? It's not Tuesday. If it was Tuesday, I would have absolutely stuck that on there. But it's not Tuesday. It's um, it's Thursday. No, it's Friday. Today is Friday. I'm missing a day. No, I don't think I'll add anything else. I'm just wasting your time because I'm a time waster. Okay, so there's my in the garden. We can mark that off. I do in the garden every day. In the garden. And we've done Wonderlust. And so then I need to work on some more. Mm -hmm. Okay. Some of them are hard. You're challenging me, Meg. Absolute challenge. So there's my in the garden page. And as you can see, I am jumping from one page to the next. And then here, oh no, that was the other day, favourite supplies. And then here is my Wonderlust. I really like that page. I really do like that. I'll do a little bit of writing there. And then it's finished. So I hope you enjoyed that. Another two pages done. I'm, I probably would choose a couple and do some to get those going and show you those, um, you know, after what you, when I do my next one on video. And um, just a minute, I've got my little nephews there. I, I, haven't, I haven't asked permission, so I don't want to get in. You know, I don't want to offend anyone. So there, that one there. Yeah, let's put that like that. Um, I love that page. And then there's that page. That page is done. So you're slowly filling it up. Good. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that. I am having so much fun with this. I, I look forward to someone or Meg or someone else doing another list and maybe I'll do another one but I, I don't know if I'll fill this one up so maybe I'll, I could c continue on in there 
or something like that. So I hope you enjoyed that and um, I will see you again soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.